What's up, everybody? Miss Bobbling. Welcome to Coagulation Station. I don't know what this is about to be, but it's about to look. It looks super dope. My elbow was resting on my phone cord. I didn't like that. After a long string of poor financial decisions, you received a telecommunication from the Grand Galactic Bank. They inform you that you have somehow managed to accure 53,000 kilo credits of debt. If your debt is not resolved within three months, we will enact standard debt relief protocols. Knowing the Grand Collection Bank's debt relief protocol often involves the removal of several vital organs, you figure it's best to look for a new, stable job to pay off your debt. Wow. I definitely feel like you didn't get scammed. The only living planet in the universe. Carrion Prime. 98,000... I don't know what that is. An hour. After a night of searching, you find an opening for a clot management specialist aboard a pumping station on Carrion Prime. The pay is decent and the hours aren't too bad. It definitely beats customer service. Puzzlingly, the turnover rate of this position is unusually high. I don't know, something about maybe the fact that this planet is living? Regardless, you've always wanted to visit Carrion Prime and now seems like the perfect opportunity. Maybe you can try one of their renowned clot dogs. How bad could it be? Oh, I don't pretty bad, I feel like. Arterial map. Greater equilateral artery. You are here. You are not here. Uh, viewing intake. Stop with that. Systems, all status, or status, all systems online. Pipeline Operator's Guide, PDS Operation. This guide is intended to aid in the operation of the Product Delivery System, PDS. The Product Delivery System is responsible for the initial extraction of the blood, hereafter a product, from the reservoir below. Product extraction is vital in supplying sustenance to the colony. Locate any of the four identical terminals bearing the following pump symbol. Uh, okay. Press the metallic switch to cycle the pumps on or off. Observe the designated flow rate gauge located on the far wall. Optimal performance is outlined by the number of lights illuminated. Please note, failure to meet the designated product quota will result in the mandatory contribution of product by any and all personnel involved. Contributions include, but are not limited to partial or complete, exanguination. Too bad I don't know what that means and I don't know how to use context clues to figure out what's gonna happen to me. Anyways, I, you know, I gotta say, I feel like there's been an uptick in these job simulator games that are based in just the most dystopian nightmare situations to live in. Um, I'm super into them. I, I'm really, I really like these. Anytime I've ever found one of these weird job simulations in a, just the fucking worst setting possible, it's pretty good. There's a lot going on here also, and I'm very overwhelmed. Oh, do you think nobody remembers what you did? Hemorrhage Farm remembers. Try our new blood bites. Due to recent events, see indistant report 98S. The harpoon cabinet should remain locked unless authorized by a member of staff with a clearance of five or higher. Okay. Due to poor performance resulting from the increasingly frequent early departure of assigned personnel, the manual recall mechanism for the entry exit elevator has been disabled indefinitely. The elevator will now descend automatically once the product quota has been met. Further inquiries regarding the revised elevator protocol are discouraged. Focus your efforts on maximizing daily product output. The colony appreciates your unwavering dedication to the vital extraction process. Awesome. No surge events detected. Continue as normal. Product pumped zero, product quota 1200. All right. Toggle pumps. Pipeline A. Oh, there's a whole thing down here. Uh, I'm sure this will be fine if I leave it right. 
The clot grinder, often erroneously referred to as the masticator by personnel, serves to dispose of coagulations within the product stream. To begin, simply drop any disposable matter into the ink cake. The clot grinder will automatically initiate, that's probably fine, a brief high torque pulverization cycle. Prolonged exposure to the pulver pulverization cycle can cause migraines, hearing loss, and psychosis. Utilize standard issued ear protection. Please note, the clot grinder does not discriminate. Keep hands, arms, feet, and legs away from the intake during the operation. See incident report 98S. Remember to keep an eye out for slippery surfaces. Respect the clot grinder. Grinder. Remember not to forget to respect the clot grinder. Stare into the pipeline intake for a prolonged period of time. Taste test any amount of unrefined product, no matter how good it smells. Now in O negative. What is happening here? Okay, hang on. Stuff started happening. I had to put an end to that. Uh, pipeline operators guide lie, guide blockages. Encountering leaks and blockages within product flow is a routine occurrence. Respond promptly and efficiently to blockages using the following procedures for identification and resolution. Monitor the flow rate gauge. A small drop in flow likely indicates a leak. Leaks can be repaired with any standard repair tool. A significant and sustained drop in flow rate is indicated indicative of a potential clot blockage. Deactivate pumps and open the corresponding hatch to clear blockage. Resume operations as soon as possible. A complete cessation of flow signals the blockage of a pipeline. This is a serious issue that requires immediate action. See diving instructions. Normalization of flow rates indicates successful clot mitigation. Toggle pumps. What pump is this? Am I going to have to manage like three sites at some point? Pump court. How to handle SEs. Every rig is equipped with sensor to detect incoming surge events, SEs, informally referred to as blood waves. Surge events are uncommon, catastrophic seismic events that occur without warning. Little is known about what causes SEs, but our current understanding is that they originate from a colossal cardiac origin, organ or a series of cardiac organs deep below the surface of carrier prime. Knowing what to do in the event of an oncoming SE... Uh, is critical to your survival. An alarm will sound when a surge event is detected and a timer will start counting down the estimated time of arrival. All personnel inside diving cages should return to the surface once work has been completed. All personnel are greatly advised to use the recall elevator button located in the command room and await rescue. The rig can survive a surge event. You, however, cannot. If for some reason the elevator is not operational, only God can help you. Oh. Oh. oh, it's so bloody. All right, well, I don't want to get in there yet because I'm scared. Also, I feel like the visibility would be zero, right? Doesn't need to be opened. Oh, this, this feels like it's meant for my, many, many people to be working on, right? Doesn't that doesn't this feel like there should be lots of people here? There's a down. Is there anything down here? Oh, because I'm gonna guess you can come up through any of the elevators. I feel like there should be more railings here. Personnel are reminded to disregard any rumors of the existence of hostile life forms present in the reservoir. None of these claims have been substantiated by empirical evidence. They are nothing more than the result of idle fear-mongering. Similar to Earth, cryptids such as the Loch Ness Monster Bigfoot or the Koala. Ad anendum. Personnel who remain unconvinced should be made aware that based on data from Earth, they are statistically 50 times more likely to die in a clock grinder related accident than any marine fauna they may encounter. Reminder, clock grinder usage is still mandatory and failure to dispose of blockages will result in punitive action. Wait, there's a pipe down here? Oh no, that's pipeline C. Is this for all of the pumps? Locked wall pump is active. 
Oh. That's, oh, that's a different thing. Claw, complete cease. Oh, okay. I think I understand. Oh. I don't like that. Oh, yeah, that's right. What do I do in a surge event? Remove blockage. Use plot grinder. Awesome. I got it, I got it. Yep. Okay, that means it's fine. Oh, I hate that. Shut him down, run over, open the hatch. Clock grind it. Good. Vein floor. Intake A, intake B, intake C has no signal. I gotcha, I gotcha. Easy, this is easy. This is an easy job. Yeah, it was just a lot to take in at first, you know? The scan system consists of a series of cameras. Oh, I can look. If I'm A blocked. Well, hang on, I'm looking at the cameras. Okay, I'm going, I'm going. Hold this up. Pipe depth. Depth surface. Pipe depth 35 meters. Oh, yeah, it's awful. Oh, it's awful down here. Hmm. This is actually maybe the worst. Is this the pipe in front of me? I don't want to look around. I don't want to invite that. Oh, I hate it. I understand how this works. You know, I was at a hotel recently by myself. Um, and... Ooh, blood whale. That's exciting. Um, I was one night, it was like midnight or whatever. I had gotten done doing the stuff I was uh, sent to do. 
Um, and I looked at the peephole at the door. For some reason, I don't know why. I was so tired. I was getting ready to go to bed. I was like making sure everything was like, was like turn off lights and shit. And I looked at the peephole and I went, I'm gonna look at that peephole. And then I thought I had just a split second later. I went, mm, I'm not gonna look at that peephole. You know, I don't like just listen. I'm like a thousand percent certain that there was nothing on the other side of that peephole that was gonna be bad. But there was a 99% chance that there was nobody on the other side of that peephole. Even if somebody had been walking down the hallway, I would have been like, mm, well, now I'm going to have problems sleeping. God damn. It's a busy life being a fucking engineer. Is there a clock grinder over here or something? Like, what the fuck? And get it. Nope, still got me. I did forget that it closes automatically. Good, good, good. Yeah, this isn't a very good system. Hmm. Oh, there's another leak. Fuck was that? Oh, uh, what do I do about that? Does that mean I just have to get out of here before that timer goes off? Okay, no, yeah, no, I do. Yeah, because the only way the elevator will come down is if I complete my quota. So I have to get my quota completed. So I need these pipes to not fucking fail me. I feel like that's a lot of time, considering I'm a third of the way there, and it definitely, it's been 17 minutes. I spent a lot of time doing nothing, though. Uh, there was a lot of walking around. What the fuck? Is that me? I'm ready, though. Oh, I don't like now that no now that nothing's happening. What is that? Oh, that's the surge event. Uh, pipe B is blocked. Okay, I'm working on it. I'm not looking around. Listen, I understand. Listen, I understand it's a game and there's probably cool shit to see. I don't want to see it. It seems like it's going to be scary. Oh, hang in there. I need you to go up, please. I don't like this game. I don't think this is a good game anymore. I think this game sucks. I don't want to play it anymore. Also, there's no diving suit down here. I'm gonna leave one up here. I know I'm gonna need one down there, though. Oh. I don't know why it says you are not here. I'm not th actually there, am I? Oh my fucking god!
This game is dead to me. This game, this game is fucking dead to me. I'm mad. I'm upset. See, no, look, I went up. No, no, that's not great timing, actually, is it? I need to get to 800 before in two minutes, otherwise I'm not ahead on. Oh, this is gonna be close. Oh, it's gonna be close. Pipe A is blocked. I don't know if I'm gonna make it, guys. I like it down here. It's scary. I keep playing these underwater ones and nope, nope. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. That's cool. It's cool the way you guys lie to your employees. Okay. Well, that seemed unnecessary. Where is this one at? I think it's over here. I'm intense. I'm tense right now. I'm a tense boy. Tense lad. Oh, is that so you could see that one in case you didn't see it earlier? Alright, is it gonna jump scare me again? Nope. Oh, it's definitely bigger though. I don't know if I have this. It's not great. It's not looking great. I always forget how to get out of there. Oh, shit's broken over here. Two cameras I got. I don't know what's up with the vein floor. I don't know why that's a thing I can look at. Doesn't help me any. Also, this elevator is not going to get here in time. Even if I got this quota, I don't think I'm going to be able to get out of here.
Oh, there's a spot for a scoop of right here. Cool. Well, this is the end of the game, I think. Because, listen, the only reason there's not a scuba suit here is because this person didn't get it back. Oh, this is lower than, I think, the vein floor set. I think that was at 52. Uh-oh. Mm, that looks like four... Showing. Closer. What's that? That's unfortunate. It's unfortunate. Hi. Oh, well. okay. Yep. Nope. I knew it. See? After you failed to report in the following day, a search team was dispatched. They discovered what was left of your, you several hours later. Your remains were then sent to the Grand Galactic Bank Oregon Harvesting Center. At least you don't have to worry about your debt when you're dead, right? Ultimately, this was the latest tragedy in a long line of tragedies to occur at this pumping station. Nevertheless, as long as the demand for clot dogs is high, the blood must be pumped. Not after, not long after the job listing for a clot management special, oh, specialist opens once more. Dark ending. There's a light ending. Why'd you get a different ending? Would you just let the timer run out? I'm not doing that. But I did like this. Yeah, how would you have done better? Oh. There's credits. Didn't think that was gonna happen. That doesn't usually happen. What is happening? It was a cool game, though. I really liked this game. Um, I like these credits. I like that, I like that there's credits. These games usually just kind of end. Uh, no, this was a super cool game, though. I like the concept. I like, you know, like I said before, I like the job simulator stuff that really... I don't know. It's really interesting. It's really cool world building for just, like, a little snippet of a world that you don't see anything more of. Like, it's super cool. Um, oh, did the big on you could close the music. No, it's a super cool game though. I really liked it. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Or don't up to you. You're not percent after all. I'll see you all later. Unless there's something here, then we'll see it together. Because I'm gonna watch these. But I'm gonna <gasps> Mr. Mittens! I'm gonna look at my phone real quick. Hey. Who's coughing? What are you doing? You gonna throw up up there? Don't do that. I'd prefer it if you got down. Especially on the hardwood floor. It's not hardwood, it's laminate. Don't think I live anywhere fancy. No! <laughs> you can't end a video like this! You can't end the credits like that! <coughs> oh man, that was awful. What the fuck is wrong with you people?